Miami Heat. Uh, the series price here, almost 4-1 to one to get the Heat against the Bucks. Now, has Milwaukee shown you in these first couple of weeks of the playoffs that they are still a runaway favorite as they are being priced in the Eastern Conference? Okay, so I was, I'm was i as intrigued by this number as everyone else that sees it, which scares me a little bit because those tall towers in Las Vegas, they did not build themselves, okay? There's a reason because everyone's running to bet the Miami Heat at a plus 400 number where you go, they're not a 4-1 to underdog yeah. against this team. You feel like from a basketball X's and O's standpoint, it's a coin flip. But from a mathematical standpoint, when you crunch the numbers that they're plus 190 in game one, and if they average plus 190, they should actually be about plus 470 for the series. My opinion is the average is going to be around plus 150, which equates to less than plus 400. That's a math equation. But let's talk about the actual basketball for a second. And they have the exact style of defense, and they have the personnel. They have the horses in the stable, which is the exact antidote of how you're never going to stop Giannis Antetokounmpo, but you can certainly contain him. The shell defense, when you throw guys like the, the Bam out of Bios, who's got this reputation as the Giannis stopper, which should not exist, but it does. You have Jay Crowder, you have Jimmy Butler. You just have bodies on bodies on bodies that you can throw at this guy, and they are going to force teams to beat them from the outside. And while Milwaukee Bucks can surround you with four great jump shooters, they've proven in the past that, when Budenholzer, when his teams get into the half court, it is different from those teams that lead the league in efficiency, pace and space. They want to beat you. They want to get downhill and start that avalanche of offense. Because if there is a team out there that can put 13 points on the board in a 13-0 run in the time that it takes you to go to the bathroom and come back, it's the Milwaukee Bucks. It had been the death line of small ball warriors before it. It's this year's Bucks. But in my opinion, they, the Miami Heat will force their will, make the Bucks play their game. The only question is, can they do it four out of seven times, which is always the question when it comes to an NBA playoff series.